Good evening, Justice. Welcome to Dan Pena's QLA seminar. I've got a few questions for you, and we'll just let your answers on them. Are you glad you attended the Castle seminar, and why? I'm ecstatic. I, uh, it was a very last-minute decision for me, um, having been an entrepreneur pretty well all my life. Uh, it's it's uh, important to once in a while wake up um, and get straightened out on the path that you're on. As advertised, does Dan make you take responsibility? Um, he demands it, you know, whether you like it or not. I believe he demands it, and he demands it in a, in a, in w with respect, uh, not not just by merely saying, uh, you know, do, do this list of things, and, and but it, but he demands uh, respect, uh, and therefore you do it. Was there a point during the week when something struck you differently than it had in the past, a like eureka moment, an aha moment? You know, during during the week, there's there's probably you know, let's say, twenty moments that are that are that are outstanding. Um, one that that really stuck out for me is uh, you know, as an entrepreneur, sometimes you can be lost. You can think that you're by yourself, or that that uh, you know you're the only one kind of rolling down down the sea in this little boat. And you often forget that really uh, the key to to success is surrounding yourself with people who have uh, rowed the boat before and don't be afraid to uh, to include them in your in your life as mentors or mentees and so I think that's the part that uh, that really hit home for me and which I will be implementing uh, immediately upon my arrival back in Canada has your vision of what you can achieve grown or changed and in what way I, I think the it's, it's a good question. The, the, the biggest um, change really is not so much the maybe that I can row the boat across the ocean because I'm doing that and I'm, I'm in the middle of the waves. Um, but I think I would, you know, to keep in the same narrative of the boat, I would say that uh, that the boat maybe just became a little bit more stable and it maybe just got another horsepower or two on the engine and it just it's just able to go across that lake that much uh, better with more confidence and uh, and the knowledge that uh, that again, you know, uh, there's other people that are cheering you on along the way. Uh, you just have to ask them to cheer. Dan talks a lot about taking action now. Do you have plans of what you would like to achieve in the next 21 days or 21 hours even? Um, have you got three examples of what you might want to change almost immediately? Or? I have two beautiful kids, uh, an 11 year old daughter and a four year old son. And uh, when, you, when you hear and, uh, you know, again, with respect, listen to Dan speak about his upbringing uh, by his fairly stern father and, and, uh, and obviously by a very regimented mother. Um, and when he, you know, in our first meeting, he said, uh, Justice, you know, your 11-year-old daughter uh, is lost. Uh, you know, of course, he means that, 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 that differently than, than what I now understand it. But uh, so one of the things that I will be implementing is uh, spending more attention and giving more detail to the way uh, my children are raised. Um, and then beyond that, I will uh, be implementing the, um, you know, the, the, the weekly updates uh, that he demands from us as mentees. Uh, down the line to my staff and my personnel. So I will be uh, demanding more accountability from the employees that uh, we employ. Are you pleased with what the final outcome of the seminar is? How would you rate it to 1 in 100? From the seminar perspective, 100%. Fantastic grounds, great food, awesome mentorship. Uh, again, you learn to gain respect for Dan by the end of the week. There's no question. Um, you know, I'm probably not happy uh, that I that I didn't uh, do this sooner, only because I didn't know of Dan. Um, so, I mean, that in that sense, I'm disappointed, but I'm I'm, I'm ecstatic. I'm going home. Uh, I think uh, a better man uh, and uh, and with with more perspective. Uh, you know, other options uh, to make money and to uh, to do right by uh, by uh, you know in the time that you've been given to live on this earth. What would you recommend to those watching this on YouTube? Um, 
you know, if if you're an entrepreneur like myself, and uh, and you look at the uh, the time commitment that it takes, you know, a week away from any any for anybody that's uh, very hands on in their business is very challenging. Uh, you know, let alone going on holidays. Um, so I would say, uh, based on the opportunities that you get presented with, or the 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 the, the mind shift, um, I would suggest. To any entrepreneur that I will meet going forward, that as long as Dan is having this course, I would uh, highly recommend it. Um, I may, you know, not recommend it only because uh, uh, you know I might end up with some competition in my backyard, so I might just keep that at sometimes close to my chest. <laughs>